Michael, I'd say your points the least you deserved tonight. Yeah, it certainly was. You know, we look, we made hard work of it. Not not in terms of how we played, but just how the how the game, the story of the game, really. You know, we, we should have been ahead early in the game. Brilliant effort from Lewis off the post. We had other chances in the first half that we could have done better with. And then, um, you know, we have a lot of chances to go ahead and we don't take them in terms of great balls across the box. No one's there to finish them. And then we go behind to like it's a brilliant strike from the lad. We look at it and possibly think we could have done better defensively getting up to the ball. But, you know, our reaction after that was terrific because the game by nature is disrupted at that point by the opposition. Um, and, you know, a brilliant goal from Lewis and, and we had other chances to, to, to win the game. And, you know, the, like, I wouldn't, the, a point was the least we deserve. We deserve more than we got tonight. And the late nature of the goal certainly shows the team are fighting. They've got plenty of spirit. Yeah, there's great spirit in the dressing room. This is a good group of lads. You know, a lot of younger players in the dressing room as well. Um, some new players at the club, some lone players. So the attitude of the players was terrific tonight. And Lewis Baker, you know, he's got that in his locker. Yeah, Lewis is. I mean, that's his fifth goal. Um, I think in maybe 10 or 12, 11 games, is it? 11 games, I think. So yeah, he's a brilliant start to his career here. And I'm sure he's like, you know, you can see Lewis is a winner. He wants to play on a team that's winning and, you know, he's going to be an important part of this team going forward. And he was unfortunate as well, early doors with, with the shot. I mean, if that had gone in, it could have been a different game. Yeah, yeah look, you know, we, there's a pattern in our play at the minute and it's existed for quite some time. And a lot of games at 0-0, we've missed a lot of chances. And, uh, you know, it reminded me a little bit like the game away at Bristol City and then you can lose a game like this. And we, and we nearly lost the game tonight, which would have been uh, a travesty, really. And... Um, yeah, we've just got to be, you know, find a way to be more clinical when the game's at nil-nil. And, you know, a lot of our play was really, really good tonight. But unfortunately, um, you know, we didn't have that finishing touch, which then when you score, the game becomes a little bit easier and the opposition have to come out a little bit more and then you get more opportunities as a result of that. What went through your mind when Barnsley scored with one of their few chances of the game? Well, you kind of think, look, here we go again. You know, it's been a pattern, but... Um, I said to the players, make sure that you know they could come in after the game and look each other in the eye, and certainly could do that given the what you know what they gave us tonight. You said against the game, you wanted to see a reaction from your side. Do you feel as though you got that? Yeah, I think we did. You know, we went through the game on Saturday. We, we were disappointed with aspects of the game, um, but I thought we saw a great reaction tonight. And it's an important result as well because it stops the run of defeats. Yeah, it does. Like it, it, tonight was about you know just I think you know showing a bit of character, show, which we did. Uh, Clearly, you know, just playing the game in front of us and not being, you know, talking about all the other stuff and where we are in the league and whether we can make the top six. And, you know, we need we need to get back to winning games. We didn't win the game tonight, um, but certainly we showed enough character to, to show that we should, we could have won the game and should have won the game. Against the game, you had a bit of bad injury news in terms of Nick Powell and Liam Moore. Can you just bring us up to date with their situations? Well, Nick Powell has a quad injury and we understand he'll be four to six weeks. So, uh, yeah, he's... You know, had a very stop-start season next. So, um, and uh, Liam Moore, I don't think his knees as bad as as maybe what we first feared. So, I think we'll see Liam maybe in, in you know a couple of weeks. Hopefully, Tommy Smith has an ankle injury, and Morgan Fox has an ankle injury. So, look, those those are injuries that we have to deal with. Um, but yeah, you know, I, I was pleased with what we got tonight. We've younger players coming into the team, and uh, you know they gave a good account of themselves.